it is, um, so you don't have a problem with being able to get shelter plus. We can try to get that for you. I don't see it being a problem for you specifically. Uh, hopefully I can because you see, uh, like I said, I've been even, I did get the shelter, you know, I was in the apartment. Yeah. And somehow they, they, they did everything possibly to kick yeah. me out and the, you know, the, the uh, disfranchise and uh, yeah. decommission. So uh, my concern is that I wanted to take your word that I'm going to be here Friday, whatever the time is, yeah. and I don't want to be that to be uh, a handicapped for me to be, to get in this program because I'm in desperate need again. Okay. And I, I don't want to, yeah. because if it's uh, the last day <laughs> of the program, I don't want to, you know. So yeah. I just want to make sure that I will get that shot at it again. You, it all depends. The thing is, she will fill out the application and do everything that she needs. Once she turns it in, and if there's anything that's missing on the application, you're not going to be, you're not, you're not going to, it's not going to, it's not going to take you away from the pos the, the, the application. All right. The application you have to complete. If there's any discrepancies or anything that's missing, she will contact you and she will tell you, look, we need additional information. So your, your application is still in the system and it will continue to be processed from them. But the thing is, we need to make sure that you have everything for the application. You need to have show proof. Um, you need to have a letter stating that you're homeless or what have you. Uh, and you can talk to, um, I could have you talk to Liz so she can go over the details. So by the time you see her on Friday, she can, she can you'll have the documents that you need by then. Okay. Does that uh, make sense? Yes, they okay. can, uh, it does. But I already have all these documents. Yeah, they, they, they already. You see, <laughs> if you had they, they are. They, I'm not new. I, well, I've been homeless. Yes. Yeah, so you, you know, and they took everything from the apartment. I mean, I'm, I'm. Come on. I, I, I've been going through this for the last t okay. six years. Okay. So I, I don't want it to. <laughs> Anything because this is exactly the paper trail and where you have you been and why you didn't come up. On I am a mental. I'm a mental case. I, I, all I worry about finding a place, a safe place to sleep, okay. and take my medication so I can get three, four hours a night to sleep. That's uh, that's all I care about. I don't yeah, yeah. So I, uh, my, my, my. You see, I'm not trying to be difficult by any stretch of the imagination, but. This is exactly what I've been going through. Bring this and uh, you, you know, they asked me to prove to prove my citizenship yeah. uh, when I was getting uh, a public health, I mean, uh, assistant, public assistant for my children. I was a single dad, and I took I took that stack, that mm -hmm. thing, and I give it to them. And yet, everywhere I go from now on, what is your citizenship? They stole my the government. They took my citizenship and my children, mm -hmm. social security, and so it's sickening. I'm sorry, but anyway. Okay. Well, the point is. Friday.